Hello everyone and welcome back to another badass YouTube video. Today we are going after the beard. I figured since I have the inability to grow one myself, I'm going to go take one from a different animal. Let's get after it. Alright guys, I went out this morning on some private land and heard a lot of gobbling going on pretty far off. I tried to call them in. Didn't have my camera equipment set up quite right. I was missing a lot of stuff, so not a whole lot of video from this morning, but I've got two good hard days of hunting. So right now I'm just driving around looking at different public land, um, looking for birds, you know. I saw a couple on some other private land. One guy I knew and I gave him a call, but he didn't pick up, so... Um, nothing I could do there. Big Tom and a couple hens out in his field, but yeah, so I'm just going to drive around for the next couple hours and then probably head back out around, you know, two or three and then sit on private land again and keep after it. I guess I just saw one, just a head sticking up on this land that I actually hunt down in the corner over there. I'm going to try and get up on my car and see if I can't see it and see what it is. And, uh, I'll let you guys know if it's if it's uh, Tom, I might try and sneak down the road and come up through those trees on it, real slow and quiet. So, um, yeah, I'll let you guys know. Got a pretty good look. Uh, looks to be a hen out there. Still cool though. God, they're moving today. Just got up to this public land and a hen was about to cross right at the corner of this driveway. stuff. I pheasant hunted it a couple times, but I've never seen a turkey out there. Here, I'll pull in here. Right, I think I'll sit here for a couple minutes and see if I see anything. the road right over here. Yeah, maybe I'll hunt there tonight. That's right where I saw the hen too. Just walking. Man. Maybe I'll hunt here tonight. We'll see. I'm going to keep driving around a little bit, but I'll mark this spot. Dang, so close.
I saw three hens on the way in, just on the other side of that thicket. I don't think they saw me, so I just set my decoy about 30 yards up that way. And I'm uh, gonna sit here for the night, and hopefully a tom comes in, and you know, we can get our bird. Been doing a couple calls. Heard one kind of goblin back up that way quite a ways. So uh, hopefully he comes in.
I'd say not bad for a first year turkey hunting. I think I called that one in. I was calling every like 10 minutes or so and then I just kind of sit there take a break and then uh, <laughs> I actually I called one last time and then I laid down on my pack back there to take a, a nap. I was like I'll just lay down and then as soon as my head hit I heard one answer and I was like dang that sounded a little bit far off and that's when I, I picked up the camera kept calling a little bit and it kept answering and then once it got kind of close um, and I couldn't it, it kind of stopped answering and I was like it must be getting close so I stopped calling and I saw its head just peeking up over the hill checking out the decoy unfortunately it didn't come all the way in stopped at at like 60 yards maybe I messed up by by calling it there but I don't really know I'll have to do some more research on what to do because I was kind of clueless but either way awesome awesome to have that happen especially first year I mean my heart was going and you know that's what it's all about so I'll sit out here some guy just came through mowing the trails um, I met him talked to him for a bit so I assume it's gonna be quiet here for a little bit um, so I figured I'd update you guys and then uh, you know get back after it so catch up with you guys when today is done hopefully this is the last day of the weekend and I got a couple more days after this but might try and get out after work and come out here and hunt some more um, but yeah I'll catch up with you guys then alright guys I hear family uh, coming through here on a four wheeler sounds like they're morale hunting and I just don't feel like it's worth it to be out here for the rest of the night it's still after seven I mean, if they're gonna be out here for a little bit of time then you know it's gonna leave less than an hour to hunt so I think I'll just call it a day and uh, come back tomorrow afternoon hopefully and uh, try and get a bird then the fact that there's all this going on in the woods we still saw one um, I consider that a win uh, too bad I didn't get a shot at it but you know that's gonna happen all right guys just got out here it's a little after four last day Hopefully uh, we can shoot a bird today. I got my Jake and Hen decoy out there. It's a hot one, so I found a nice shady spot in some woods. And uh, hopefully we can call one in and, you know, fill our tag. It'd be awesome, so stay tuned. All right, guys, there's about 20 minutes left on my season. Obviously didn't get a bird, but I still feel like it was a huge success. It's my first season out, and, you know, I learned a lot. I called in a turkey, which I thought was crazy. I didn't think I was gonna be able to in my first season. I uh, didn't get a shot at it, stayed pretty far out. So that's unfortunate, but still a good thing. And this has got me really fired up to come out again and uh, give it another shot. I'm super pumped for my next time turkey hunting already. So um, it was an awesome season. Like I said, can't wait to do it again. Um, if you guys enjoy this type of content, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.